like the battle Couldn't end in victory In the chaos and confusion Is all that you can see There's a voice that calls out Louder than the noise A whisper in the madness Oh, hear the Father's voice Saying, come to me I know the burden's heavy You can lay it at my feet Come to me When your heart is just too weary I will be your strength Just come to me Does it feel like the valley Is the place that you call calls out in the darkest night I will be your rescue I've already won that fight sing come to me I know the burdens heavy you can lay it at my Well, hello, team. Good to hey. see you. Hello. Good to see you. Man, it's so great. You guys have a lot of your team here. I mean, not everyone, because you have a big team. There's like we 50 of yeah. <laughs> 14 to be exact. And we're all somewhat related to each other. We're all related. <laughs> yeah. Well, and we're here at your home church, Lakewood Church, yeah. here yeah. in Houston. Houston. And it's, it's a beautiful place. And, um, and we were together last night. You guys actually recorded a live album last night. We Which did. is amazing that you're still talking and functioning <laughs> yeah. coherently this morning. <laughs> but it was an amazing night and just, you know, the, the songs are just uh, so powerful. And so congratulations. Thank you you so guys much. worked so hard on those. Um, and you actually recorded last night and then you recorded a piece um, the night before mm -hmm. with a song called Come to Me, which yeah. you did with Patrick Mayberry. Yeah. Yeah. And Patrick couldn't be at the recording last night, but you guys tracked and did video the night before with him. And we yeah. got to see that last night, which was really powerful. But Alexander, this song and the lyric is so powerful. I, I see this as it's just one of those songs that you could just sing over your church. Like there's not a lot of those great invitation songs written mm -hmm. anymore. We're just calling people yeah. uh, to God. And mm -hmm. so, but talk about the song a little bit and the thoughts behind it. Yeah. 
It's a really special song to all of us. I, I've loved like being able to lead it and sing it. We wrote it with Patrick, which was really cool. Um, and it comes from the scripture in Matthew. It says, come to me all who are weary and burdened down and I will mm. give you rest. And that's really the heart of the song. You know, in life, there are times when you are weary and burdened down. And there's a lot of places you can turn, a lot of things you can look to. But Jesus, when you look to Jesus, he gives you the rest that the world can't give you and the world can't take away from you. You know, there's a lot of things that sometimes feel easier to look to than Jesus in those moments. Mm -hmm. But he's really, he's always the source of our strength, of our peace. He gives us the grace for every season. And, you know, it really just comes, you, you find yourself in hard places sometimes. And it's a, it's a beautiful reminder to just know that Jesus is always there and he always welcomes us. He, he never leaves, you know, mm. it says come to me, but, but we really always, he's always with us. Yeah, yeah. And it's just making the decision to go to him it's, instead of the other things of the world that we could, because he's, he's just the source yeah. of everything we need. Wow. Yeah. And this song being in that first person too, just mm -hmm. makes it super powerful. It's yeah. like you're seeing yeah. that, you know, when, when, when you're sitting out there and, and you guys are singing it, it just, it's like, wow, it's like I hear the words of Jesus in that yeah. mm -hmm. they call me is just really powerful. Yeah. And the rest of that scripture says, take my yoke upon you for my yoke is easy and its burden mm -hmm. is light. Mm -hmm. And you know, when in farming, they would yoke two oxen together and the stronger one and the weaker one would be yoked together and the stronger one would take the heavier load mm -hmm. of what they were carrying. And I think just last night as we were singing it over people, I could see the burdens being lifted, mm -hmm. lifted mm -hmm. and people just giving that heavy load to Jesus and going, I'm gonna be yoked up with you because mm -hmm. your yoke is easy and its burden is light. And as those, as those burdens are lifted, I think mm. people just start to live in freedom. Yeah. And I think that's the feel behind the entire song, the spirit behind it is, I want freedom. I want freedom in Jesus. Mm -hmm. Here, take my load, take my burden. It's all yours. I'm going to be free. Yes. You are preaching right now. <laughs> 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 I like it. My gosh. <laughs> Shabbat. Oh. Oh. This song is just like, for me, it's just like a, a hug. Like, come oh. on. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Let's we'll tug it out. Brothers. You know? It's the first time I've ever hugged him. Yeah. <laughs> never had. Yeah. Exclusive here on Worship Together. <laughs> but it just feels that. It's like, hey, come on. And mm -hmm. then just, God's got this. And then I think that's what people need to hear. Yeah. And where people have journeyed through, uh, like Alexander said, a lot of people have gone through a lot of life. Uh, uh, there's been a lot of things that have happened in this world. And, um, they just maybe for a second forgot that they can take those burdens, yeah. those messes and bring them to Jesus. Mm -hmm. And this is that reminder of that, mm -hmm. so. Wow, yeah. such a powerful song. Mm -hmm. And just the, you know, the, the thought of this song, you know, there's so much happening in the world and even in the last couple of years, yeah. you know, just with everything that's going on. And even today with, you know, just all the problems in the world, you know, a message like this where it's allowing people to, you know, to bring, just mm -hmm. like whatever it is that they care yeah. on you. And I, I think some songs, sometimes they just have a unique, there's a unique piece of them that from the church that they come out of. And so I think of Lakewood and just think of, uh, of that message that Lakewood is, is just, it's so well known for, of just yeah. like encouragement and like you who are you like come mm -hmm. and experience the life of Jesus, experience that, mm -hmm. him taking that burden from you. Yeah. Yeah. Just, you know, just what a powerful statement that is. Yeah. yeah. I remember when I showed it to my wife for the first time, the demo, she literally started crying in the car next mm. to me. So I don't know if they were good, if that was a good or a bad thing, yeah, yeah. but it ended up being a good thing. And it, that just showed me that the song could have the potential to really touch someone. Yeah. And, and let me just say, um, Patrick Mayberry has the voice of an angel. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Don't tell him that. I'm giving the yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, very yeah, deep tone, tone raspy angel. But he, I think he's like uh, the male version of Mariah Carey. He, <laughs> oh, oh. It's that good. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> when we wrote the song with him, he sang the demo for us. Yeah. And we were like... Okay, this demo, we can release this demo. Yeah, like, it's yeah. that good. <laughs> and special and we, shout out to David Moffat was yes, with us Yes, David too. Moffat wrote it with us. It was a really oh, cool experience. Awesome. I felt like we brought the idea and it just felt like everyone in the room really grasped what we were wanting to say. Especially like, it almost can, it's, it's hard when you talk about hard things, when you say, when it yeah. feels like the battle couldn't end in victory, yeah. when it feels like the valley is your home. Like, 
But then I love the bridge because it says the door was always open. You were never broken. You were always mine. Like wow. the truth of God. You're in these situations in their real life, but that's always the truth. That's always the reality. You just have to come to him. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So good. Well, guys, I can't wait for churches to be able to sing this song. Yeah, I think it's yes. going to be just powerful ministry moments, whatever it's sung. And so thank you so much for sharing it with us. Thank you so much. <laughs>